Hey, we're here with the new iPad Pro, and this thing is all screen. You're taking a look at the 12.9 inch model, which starts at 999, and you can see the difference here between the previous iPad Pro and this model. So much less in the way of bezels, no more home button, because just like the iPhone, you're supposed to operate this thing with gestures, uh, and it works very well. And the true depth camera is up here for Face ID. So that's the easy way to unlock your device and get in, and it also works for payments. Uh, in terms of performance, they're really talking up the A12 Bionic processor, and this is the A12X. So in a game like this, you could see amazing amounts of uh, level of detail. They're saying that it's console level graphics in the iPad, and this thing is like super thin. So the fact that they're able to get this power in something so tiny uh, is pretty amazing. And you get uh, four speakers on here, so you can't notice it here, but it is very loud. Uh, the real magic happens when you start connecting via USB-C, which is a new port for this, and uh, the folio keyboard, which is an option. So if I snap this in and then get this going, you can see that it's a lot easier than before to get attach a keyboard, and this is going to be an option. Then I could start connecting to an external monitor and use an application like iMovie so that I could be editing my film and be outputting at the same time. And this is really great for multitasking that you haven't been able to do before on an iPad, or at least not as easily. One of the things that we really like about the new iPad Pro is how the Apple Pencil attaches. It's magnetic and it's very strong, unlike some other two-in-ones that we've tried. So once you attach it, you'll see that it automatically charges up top and you should see it like a little message come up, Apple Pencil, and then the percentage charge. So it's very easy and it's so strong that even when I go like this, it doesn't shake free. So when this is in your bag, chances are it's not gonna shake loose, which is really nice to have. And the Apple Pencil itself has some really cool gestures, uh, including like, so when you're writing and you wanna erase, you just double tap, you see that the eraser comes up and I just go like this. So, and developers gonna be able to take advantage of different gestures and different apps. So it's pretty convenient to have. So this is just our first look at the iPad Pro. This is the 12.9 inch model that'll go for $999. The accessories will cost extra. Uh, but so far, really, really impressed with the performance and especially just how light and thin this thing is. Stay tuned for our full review from Laptop Mag. This is Mark Spoonauer.